how small of a car can you use to pull a scamp? Oh, well, let's show you. Guys, welcome to Playing With Sticks. Today we are taking out a scamp trailer. We have wanted to do this for a long time, so we took it down to Girdwood, uh, one of our favorite places. Just get it in the rainforest, hopefully uh, check out the mine today, and um, we're just gonna see if that's something we're into. We've been pulling this, uh, you know, our tiny trailer along, our little teardrop, but we've never pulled a scamp, and obviously we made it. So we just went an hour out of town through Alaska and then back out to our campsite then in for food and now we're leaving our campsite again with this scamp on with this four cylinder vehicle we're still on full. That's pretty impressive. All in my mind and Though I know that there is nothing to find Your beautiful sight in the summer night Yeah, that's right, that's a four cylinder vehicle pulling this thing and it's working and it feels pretty good. I don't think we could take it up a mountain, uh, but we can definitely get from point A to point Z. We've went north of our hometown an hour, south of our hometown of an hour, and both ways have worked. All right, let's get out of here. Come on, East, let's get in. It's time to go check this thing out. I love that you can stand up in it. I love that there's just a little bit more space to like, for those days where you just don't wanna be outside, like you just wanna stay in here, it's cozy. Really the space. I mean, I thought I was a teardrop kind of gal, but I think I'm a scamp kind of gal. <laughs> <laughs> Next week you'll be a teardrop type Next of week I'll be a teardrop because I have no choice. I love all the windows. Like we were laying in here last night and we just felt like it, felt like we were outside. Our, our teardrop is, just has no windows <laughs> well two windows like with the doors but they're kind of uh, tinted so it's dark and but these you feel like you're outside like we woke up yesterday and we were just looking at the mountains and it was beautiful and we get the same view with our teardrop we just have to open our door coffee the best part is just being able to wake up and cook your coffee right here in your pajamas and not have to like put a sweater on to go outside to turn on your little um, propane grill Clouds and thunders standing in my way I must try to figure it out in a way. So I love all the cupboard space. Like in here you can put your pots and pans, toothbrush and hand wash stuff. Um, back here I just love how we can we use it as our pantry and our um, rain gear so you can see our umbrellas in here. If you know me, you know that I love the kitchen factor and this is definitely the cutesy factor um i just it's just so cottagey and cute and nooky and just petite and tiny and that's what i like the bed that's the one i was under impressed the with. bed that is a really big awesome. section of storage if you have like a dog this is where your dog would sleep <laughs> and then even here is another spot or your other dog. <laughs> <laughs> For your other dog. And we actually saw a video where people did put their dogs and things like this. So I do love that this thing turns into a table. Um, so we can sit around, play cards, like watch TV. East can kind of climb around and have that little bit of space to just be himself and be a baby. Songs of worries, travel with the storm. Good morning. Are you up? Is he up? Hi, look outside. It's, what a beautiful day. Hey baby, let me get you your bagels. Breakfast bagels. Just picture yourself in the cutest coffee shop. And this is it. And the table, the size of it. It's not like a dinky toy like we it's thought It's bigger it would than be. a coffee top shop table actually. <laughs> <laughs> This is the area back here where they gold pan, and back in the day this was hopping, but there's still gold panners. We saw a guy somewhere, I don't know where he went, he took his sludge, sledge, gold pan.
All right, guys, it's been good. Crow Creek Mine, we're gonna head on to the next location. And the state's got these trucks everywhere. What are you doing? Keep going, buddy. He's, I think you lost the race, he's. I think you lost the race. I may be wrong, but it just seems like your mom beat you, like, big time. <laughs> Out of this cold stream. And East is just loving it. We've been hanging out back here in the woods and I think it's time to head out and just pick some of our vegetables or do some foraging. We've been finding all these, whoa! Uh-oh, Daddy, we need your help. Daddy, 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 blueberries, blueberries. Oh my, oh my. Okay, the blueberry patches are everywhere here. No matter where you go, there's blueberries. The ones from last time were big. These ones are like huge, huge. Can you tell I'm excited? <laughs> okay, just look. Well, they are pretty big. <laughs> Getting spiders and bugs on me right now. Totally worth it for this blueberry experience. Look it. Okay, put it in the cup. Good job. Mm -hmm. 